endoscopic treatment of food intolerance after a banded gastric bypass, inducing band erosion for removal using a plastic stent. Introduction. Banded RUNY gastric bypass, RYGB, is a common and successful bariatric procedure. Banding of the pouch is indicated to prevent postoperative dilation and loss of restriction and results in better long-term weight loss. Despite these advantages, rings are related to food intolerance and gastric outlet complications. These may lead to vomiting, excessive weight loss, and malnutrition. Historically, the treatment for ring-related complications has been surgical removal of the ring. However, these procedures can be associated with morbidities such as bleeding, pouch or limb perforation, and abdominal infection. In the long term, these procedures can also lead to weight regain as a result of pouch and gastrojejunostomy dilation. The endoscopic approach for food intolerance in banded RYGB has been limited to balloon dilation, but this is not always successful in resolving the symptoms. In addition, dilation may not even be necessary in some cases, as gastric outlet dysfunction can occur without stricture of the pouch. Blero et al. demonstrated the feasibility of using a stent for the endoscopic removal of a non-eroded ring after a vertical banded gastroplasty. In addition, Wilson et al. reported removal of an adjustable gastric band using a stent. However, there are no reports in the literature regarding the removal of the ring using a stent after a banded RYGB. The aim of this study was to evaluate the safety and effectiveness of utilizing a stent to induce erosion of the ring followed by endoscopic removal in patients with banded RYGB and food intolerance. Background and study aims. Ring complications after a banded RUNY gastric bypass, RYGB, are usually managed surgically. The aim of this study was to analyze the safety and effectiveness of endoscopic removal of non-eroded rings after banded RYGB by inducing intragastric erosion of the ring using a self-expandable plastic stent, SEPS. Patients and methods. A total of 41 patients with banded RYGB who had non-eroded rings and food intolerance were prospectively enrolled. Patients were treated with endoscopic SEPS placement and ring removal. Data from time of stenting, resolution of symptoms, need for endoscopic dilation, and complications were recorded. Results. Successful ring removal was possible in all patients. In 21 cases, the SEPS induced complete erosion, and in 17 cases, the ring was removed a month later because of incomplete erosion at the time of SEPS removal. Nine patients, 22.0%, needed endoscopic dilation after stent removal in order to treat fibrotic strictures. Food tolerance was observed in 32 patients, 78.0%, after the procedure. No patient needed surgery and there were no deaths. Conclusion, endoscopic removal of the ring using SEPS appeared to be safe and effective after abandoned RYGB.